Paige Winter is one amazing teen. Cool. I want people to see that I'm doing all right. I'm going to be able to walk. I'm going to be able to write. I'm going to be able to do just kind of like everything. It's just same old Paigey. Just last week, the 17-year-old was at the beach in North Carolina when the unthinkable happened. There has been a shark attack. There's somebody in the water bleeding. Paige was swimming when she was suddenly pulled underwater, attacked by a bull shark. Her father, Charlie, a firefighter and paramedic, saw blood in the water and sprung into action, punching the shark in the face to free his daughter. He spoke for the first time today at a hospital press conference. I immediately just started to hit it. I've read five times. It could have been ten. It could have been three. It could have, I don't know. I wasn't keeping track, but I know, um, I know I was hitting it. And I hit it with everything I could, and it let go. Paige also spoke today via a videotaped message that charmed everyone. When I was in that water, I was like praying. I'm like, I'm 17. I got so much to do. <laughs> Paige lost her left leg above the knee, as well as two fingers on her left hand. But listen to this. Sharks are still good people. And that's just kind of the truth. They're still so good. And they're so cool. <laughs> the outpouring of support cool. has been they're overwhelming. Cool. East Carolina Brace and Limb is donating a custom-made prosthetic leg for Paige that comes with a microprocessor that senses movement. I think with this situation, I can transform it into something that's not like, oh, how tragic, 17-year-old lost a leg. No, 17-year-old lost a leg and we're popping, you know?